It never fails this year. Uh, I don't know how many camping trips I've been on, nine or 10 this year. And it's found a way to rain every time. It's, luckily I hadn't actually got on the water yet, which I wanted to be at this point. I, it's two o'clock and I wanted to be on the water at noon and start my trip up on the Black River out of Clearwater and head up toward Lexington, maybe even Black. Which with the amount of rain we're getting, I may not have a problem with that, I don't know. Kind of hard to tell, I don't know how the water does, what the rain does here in, in Missouri, but either way, if I, if I hook this boat up and head somewhere, you better believe it's gonna rain when I get there this year. Uh, look, not, I don't like to use the word discouraging, but 69 degrees outside, which feels amazing. But at the same time, I was wanting it to be 96, headed up Rima. But it'll get there, just gotta be patient. Well, I'm here at the back of Clearwater Lake. She's back there. There's a bunch of geese. so oh, you can still see them. Hold on. Let's get some. Let's get some geese. Let's see them over there. They're enjoying the rain a little more than I am. Uh, hopefully they'll be gone about an hour. I kind of have a mess in my truck. When I got ready to go, I, I didn't. I just kind of threw everything in here. So I'm going to kind of lean over the seat here and straighten up and I got rain gear. Uh, I guess once I get straightened up, if it still ain't stopped raining, I may just gear up. I got my rubber boots and everything, so. Only thing I don't have is a pair of jeans, so. But I think the rain gear has jeans in them, so we'll see about that, but. I gotta get on the river because it's three o'clock and I don't know how many hours up I'm gonna run, being that I've only ran this section one time and a short bit of it. Not really sure how long it's gonna take me to get to where I wanna go, but. The good news is I'm not going anywhere. I'm just going till I find a place I want to camp, but I was kind of hoping that would be further up and in the morning I'd wake up and come back. So we're gonna watch her rain here. Straighten this truck up a little. All right, here we go. I said rain or shine and it's sure enough raining, so we're gonna do it. Go slow, we'll be in the back of the lake for a little while and just to see how it runs out. We got everything covered up that can get wet. My bag and everything's wrapped around that other top. Yeah. Do this. couple miles up already uh, I was very thankful that tree was cut out it was here back in February I was worried about that actually but I want to show you something that's just super cool to me probably normal for Missouri folks but check this out no big deal look at this little stream coming out of the rocks really how amazing is that It doesn't make any sense. There's a little low spot over here. You know, in my mind, I'm like, okay, there's gotta be a little lake or something over there, but there's nothing. Water coming out of the ground. Let's see how cold it is. It's chilly, but it ain't frigid. Huh. We're gonna go. It's kind of, the, the rain's lightening up, so happy about that easy running so far we'll probably next stop be at annapolis all right it's getting pretty western out here with the wind and it's for show sure raining uh i guess we're good i guess we're good i don't know
makes it hard to see the river with all the rain and the wind. If I find me another big bluff or something, I'll uh, maybe tuck up high and wait this little, this little thunderhead out right here. It's coming down now. I got in the, some major wind over there. It was, it was eerie. I'm up against this bluff kind of now. So it knocked the wind off of me. I feel like I don't know that. We're going to let this pass on by. Sitting still. But we're staying dry. The rain comes working great. All my stuff looks like it's staying dry. I got my pillow right here under this thing. I don't have any service either. I can't look at radar. Let's see if it's almost over or what. Just up above K Bridge now. It pretty much rained and stormed the whole way. It's pretty bad, but I'm daring that sun to come out over there. It's gonna be awesome. All right, the rain is gone. Stopped a little spot here. Lesterville isn't too much further, but hopefully I still got to put sunglasses on later. We'll see. The river ride has been incredible, though. There's been some really fun spots. I haven't done much video just because of the rain and the bimini tops all in the way. My fingers, look at them. Grandpa hands. It's all soaked down. But, uh, We'll keep riding. All right, I came up here to the first challenge. Luckily, it is done raining. Uh, I had to lower the mini top. Yeah, this goes. It's like plenty of depth. I'm not worried about depth. I'm worried about hitting something. It'll be tricky going down. I believe this is the Lesterville Bridge. There may be another one, I'm not sure, but. A little tricky spot right here is some boulders. Definitely since I've gotten further up here, there's a lot more boulders to worry about uh, in the river versus more gravel back down. But trim down here. I'm gonna go to the right, far right. Looks like my safest bed here. If I had to bet. <laughs> 